Have you ever wanted to write a book, but thought you didn't know enough about any specific topic to do so? What if I told you you didn't need to? And that today I'm gonna debunk that myth. Let me show you how. Welcome back everyone. We're gonna dive right into why you don't need to be a genius on a specific topic matter to write a book. Hey guys, so you know the deal. I'm pausing the video right here to ask you to do me a big favor and hit that subscribe button below only if you love your parents. I mean, if you don't, feel free to not hit the subscribe button or hit the subscribe button anyway. But I got a feeling that a lot of you are gonna hit the subscribe button. First thing I wanna do is compare a book to taking a class. So essentially, what you wanna do first is figure out what topic you're interested in. In my experience, you don't wanna write about something that is not interesting to you. That's why I hated writing papers, but I actually enjoyed writing my first book. Next, you wanna go through a phase uh, called getting smart, where you're doing interviews um, and you're doing a ton of research on the specific topic. Meaning you don't have to have any personal connection or you know, a large set of knowledge beforehand on the topic because what you wanna do is have this whole get smart phase beforehand anyway before you even start writing that gets you up to speed so that you can write the best book possible. Even with prior knowledge, you still wanna go through this get smart phase. And the reason why I'm comparing it to a class because essentially, what this book writing process should be like is you go through this get, far, this get smart phase, then after this entire get smart phase, so like a semester's worth of class, you have a final. But instead of your final being a test, it's your first draft of your manuscript. So that's what you should think about when you think about writing a book. You don't really need to be an expert a subject matter expert. Now subject matter experts can also write books and those books are fantastic, but there's no reason why you can't write an exceptional book while not being a genius on a topic too. I'm gonna give a little insight into my experience writing my first book. I knew pretty early on that I wanted to write about major life transitions because I felt I had just went through a major life transition. So I had the personal connection to the topic. What I didn't have was a bunch of psychological details or the know-how, the background on why people make major life transitions, why people do some of the things they do, um, what are some other circumstances outside of just the person that causes people to make major life transitions, and then what is the right way to go about these different life transitions. So even though I had background on, you know, my specific story and I had a personal connection there and what I wanted to write about, what I didn't have was a bunch of knowledge from doing research and stuff like that. So what I had to do was go through the same get smart phase that I'm recommending that you go through in starting the book process. I reached out to a ton of people um, to interview them, interview them on their major life transitions, things that they did. Also, do me a favor, in the comments below, write if you'd want me to maybe make a uh, video on how to interview people for a book. Then what I would do was after interviewing people, you know, I'd go and actually do a bunch of research. I read a couple books on the psychology and like how people's minds work um, and things of that nature. And after putting in all of that work in the get smart phase, then I was able to put together a book that helps people in a way that is better off than you know me going in there and just telling a personal story. I was also able to include the story of a lot of different people, as well as include a lot of the research that I had done to create a final product that I'm sure was able to help a few people in their major life transitions. All in all, what I'm trying to get at is that I was nowhere near 
an expert or a genius on the topic of life transitions when I decided to write this book. Through the entire book writing process, I became well equipped with the tools and the knowledge to be able to share that knowledge with everyone else. And I'm sure that you can do the same with whatever topic you choose. I hope this was super helpful and now you feel like you can write a book and I am recommending that if you do want to, that you 100% go for it. Do me a favor, like and subscribe, follow me on all of my social media platforms, link below in the description, and I'll see you on the next video.